this is Michael. <laughs> She's out of my life. I love you. To all the girls I've loved before. I would like to dedicate this song to Shirley MacLaine Oh, I just called to say I was you Look out, here comes a little James Brown Why? I feel good making his first appearance here in the United States is Japan's finest entertainer, Sheki Sakatomi. <laughs> with his uncanny portrayal of Neil Diamond. Hero again, hero. and roll and curl it in it head <laughs> Your mini skirt's so high that I can see your underwear <laughs> Here he is, your Mr. Excitement, Randy Travis. My achy, breaky heart, I just don't think you'll understand. Cause if you tell my heart, my achy, breaky heart, it might blow up and kill this man. star in country music today and thank goodness he lost some weight because he'll be the first one to tell you he was on his way to becoming the biggest star in country music today here is Garth Brooks I used to get high on sweet lamb and cream pie till I got oh so white in the Just got my boots were tied and my rear was chafing my blue jeans so white. But now I'm okay. Originally from the Doobie Brothers, here is Mr. Articulate Michael McDonald. Crystal clear, huh? <laughs> Here's Billy Joel with a song for someone we all know and love dearly, Roseanne Arnold. She's got a way 300. <laughs> and now here is Aaron Neville with a song for Don King, boxing promoter and hair inspiration for the troll doll. Look at his face I know the years are showing him Look at his hairdo It looks like it just exploded <laughs> Michael Bolton is here tonight Along with Dr. Ruth Westheimer And a song promoting the practice of safe sex
sucked with its peewee. Hey, old Ruth, yes, she rocky, and old Rocky about boy, tight style. Yeah, well, uh, hey there, Dr. Ruth. It's uh, Cliff Cleveland here from Cheers Bear. Hey, hey, hey. Well, good evening, Dr. Ruth. This is Bill Cosby. <laughs> Dr. Ruth. James T. Kirk here, Captain, Starship Enterprise. My brother. Arch, excuse me, Dr. Ruth, I'm shot a body, Lieutenant Colombo here. Hey, hello, Ruth, it's Rodney, you know, and boy, have I got a problem, okay? I'll tell you. Hey, last night, my wife, she met me at the door wearing nothing but a negligee. Problem is, she was just getting home, you know? <laughs> that ain't easy. Good evening, Dr. Ruth, it's, it's Johnny Carson. Or should I say, Kornak. The Magnificent. <laughs> you may kiss the bride. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> Name the five most expensive words in the English language. <laughs> At 90 years old, I became a country singer. I figured, why not? I'm older than most countries. <laughs> and now at 98, I'm gonna try rap. <laughs> Can't touch this. Can't use it. Can't find it. Touch the move. I shared my little body. And tonight, my little Kermit and I would like to sing you a real pretty tune. But, but this is our song, son. Now, why are there so many songs about rainbows? And watch on the other side, the current rainbows, her visions, and illusions. And rainbows have nothing to hide. Unplugged and seated, this is Rod Stewart. Now, if you guys feel like singing along with me on this one. Please don't, because it really messes me up. <laughs> Have I told you lately that I love you? Have I told you there's no one else above you? I'm standing backstage, and he's doing this imitation of my dad singing Unforgettable. And I was, I was flabbergasted. Nobody has ever done as good an imitation of my dad. And he even did me. That's, that's even harder. <laughs> Unforgettable. That's what you are. Now here's the guy they are calling the Frank Sinatra of the 90s. Young Harry Connick Jr. I'm a little bit of me and a whole lot of you. Add a dash of star and a dozen roses too. Then let it rise for a hundred years or two. And that's the recipe for making love. Well, like Harry Connick Jr., I too am a big fan of Mr. Frank Sinatra, I feel that that man, even at age 78, could sing any song ever written and turn it into something 
special as only Sinatra can. Uh, well, Flintstones. <laughs> Where was I? Well, Bonnie, Fred, Wilma, Betty, too. How they all want to rock the joint with you. Then again, yeah, he worked with me. And I'll tell you what, man, the guy absolutely destroyed the audience. And I was surprised because people kept telling me he was an actor. So I said, you're not an actor. You're an entertainer. Yeah. Al Pacino in Scent of a Woman. But first, Henry Fonda and Katherine Hepburn on Golden Pond. You want to I come back here so fast? I got to the end of our lane. I don't know where the old town road was. Oh, Norman, you're safe, and you're definitely still you. My name is Colonel Frank Slade, U.S. Army, retired. Well, gentlemen, it's time for me to go. I've got a date with a beautiful woman, and I'm driving. <laughs> and Charlie, if you ever find yourself face to face with danger, you just look danger right in the eye, and you say, who are? I'm Walter Cronkite. Welcome to the White House, where today discussing the issues will be all the living presidents and Ronald Reagan. I'd also like to welcome Mr. Ross Perot, who was not invited but showed up anyway. I'd just like to say that Hillary understands that the title First Lady is just that a title. She knows she wasn't my first lady. Read my lips. Hi. <laughs> yeah. I try. First of all, I like to say I can't believe you people actually voted for these bozos. Little girl with a red dress on She can burn that up that light of her hair Give me an arpeggio, will you? And uh, then go, go out and get me a dozen jelly donuts. Glory, glory.
says here we have a young lady in the audience celebrating a birthday tonight. See, that's great. Okay. Bobby McFerrin. Boy, I didn't do it. Kareem, oh boy, I didn't do it. Happy birthday to you, Kareem. Happy birthday to you, Kareem. Happy birthday, Carol Dorsey. Oh, happy birthday to you, Kareem. Happy birthday, Carol! I take you all to a street corner somewhere in Brooklyn, New York. Hey, this is a nice looking group on the corner with us here tonight. Hey, if you peoples want to hear us sing a song, let me hear you say, yo. Last time I was in New York, I was invited to perform at the famed Apollo Theater. And tonight, I would like to pay tribute to three Apollo legends. She was the queen of jazz, Miss Sarah Vaughan. dance for you in one of shoes <laughs> Just an impressionist? Oh, grow up. Well, Danny Gans is just a singer, just a comedian, just an actor, and just an impressionist. In other words, he's just incredible. And now I would like to take you to Broadway, but not as Danny Gans, the man of many voices. No, tonight, I am Danny Gans, Phantom of the Opera. Close your eyes, darling.
time that I maybe just sing something for you is Danny Gans. Is that all right? I dedicate this song to all of you out there who, like myself, believe that with enough hard work, dedication, and faith in the man upstairs, dreams do come true. You know a dream is like a river Ever changing as it flows And the dreamer's just a vessel That must follow where it goes Try to learn from what's behind you For never knowing what's in store Makes every day a constant battle just to stay between the shores So I will sail my vessel Till the river runs dry Like a bird upon the wind These waters on my sky I'll never reach my destination If I never try So I will sail my vessel Till the river runs dry Awesome, totally awesome. I can't believe a guy's got so much talent. I've never seen a show that good before. He is a great entertainer. Just good, clean fun. I can't believe the guy's brains. I really can't. He's blew my mind. Just incredible. Best entertainment I've ever seen in my life. He was awesome. He was great. The guy's the greatest. The absolute greatest. He is fabulous. Great looking guy. Where is he? 